How is this year's Social Good Summit different than the last two years? Well, the most exciting piece is that we're global this year. We're in Nairobi, we're in China, we're here and in 47 offices, I think, around, around the globe, which maybe Helen should talk about. But the fact that we're doing it also in all six UN languages and Hebrew is very exciting. It brings so many millions of people, and we're often talking tens of millions of people, into the global conversation. The point's been made at the opening of the summit today here in New York, that usually UN week you know, the city all closes down, it's the leaders going behind closed doors, the people are thinking, what's going on in there? Now, this is about bringing people into the conversation. What Helen said is right, we're going to engage not only at the government level, but at every sector, whether it's business or academia or nonprofits. We can't solve these problems like global poverty or women's health or AIDS without every sector being involved and so we need everybody to get into the action. And Helen? Well f first thing, accelerate action on the goals we've got. It's only 2012, the target date was 2015 so we've got UN country teams of agencies like our own very active around the world with governments, with communities, with development partners working on accelerating action. I can't emphasize too much the importance of that because if we can show good success with the MDGs that will be very positive for the next generation of goals and targets, whatever they're called.